three, as you say, for Williams at the moment. But a lot of action to come. And uh, notice how the drivers always go down into the cockpit when they brake hard. It's amazing where your body goes to. But uh, as you start to pull five times the force of gravity under heavy braking, and it's probably not quite so easy to see from this overhead angle as the one over the shoulder, but your body tends to sink submarines a little bit, despite uh, a seat that is tailor-made, almost like a Savile Row suit, to uh, keep you firmly in the cockpit. You do tend to slide down the car. Alonso then very fast in the first sector and beginning to come alive, and he needs to. Very committed through turn eight. There's the final part of it. Clean had an enormous slide. Saw the tire marks on the right there. Clean had a huge moment up there this morning. Very lucky not to hit anything. He went off the road about 175 miles an hour, but ended up on the grass. Such are the enormous runoff areas here. And I think a lot of drivers these days they drive to the runoff areas. If, if there's uh, no danger to them, they just keep their foot in it and keep planted and drive around the problem. 19,000 RPM only down the straight for the Renault. So I wonder uh, if they're giving it the full bananas moment I believe that Renault can rev a bit more than 19,000 final few corners here are so painfully slow but here comes Alonso and where does this put him relative to Ralph Schumacher it blitzes him by uh, well blitzes him it blitzes him by a, a tenth so Alonso fastest Ralph Schumacher second Heitfeldt third Weber fourth